Hey guys, welcome back. This is Demon Fox 13, and today we're continuing our Assassin's Creed 2 uh, Let's Play. Uh, today we're taking you, we're going to be doing part 4 of our walkthrough. Uh, I'm pretty sure you guys saw part 3, and uh, part 3, well, that's the thing we were supposed to do. I guess we have to go back and either check on the quest back in the city, or I don't know exactly what we have to do, but I know we have to go back for a quest. So let's go ahead and get that started. By the way, guys, I've been playing a little bit of Assassin's Creed 2 already. Made my own file, like I mentioned, in uh, <clears throat> uh, part 3, I believe, because this should be part 4. Yeah, in part 3, I mentioned I was going to be making my own file, so I did, and I've been playing, and I've been actually pretty far ahead in the game. So, just to let you guys know the heads up, I already know a lot of the things in the game, but I'm not going to spoil it for you guys, so, you know, I'm not going to say anything regarding that. But um, I got used to the game, and it's pretty awesome, so... Hopefully that helps out. It makes the game Let's Play more fun. Alright, so I guess we have to go to town, I think. Do we have to go to town? Yes, we do. But I know there's another quest you have to do in the villa. That's why I'm trying to make sure if we have to go back to town or not. Sweet. And see, like, these posters will be all over the area, I guess, and you just gotta rip them out. It'll um, lower down your, uh, your uh, what do you call it, uh, noticery, like, you know, the guards uh, won't be so, so uh, noticed to you, basically. You know, like, if you have your meter, I don't know if you see what the uh, life is at, Right next to the right side, there's like uh, Altair's face. Uh, Altair's, I'm sorry, uh, Ezio's face, or uh, with the hood. If that thing goes all the way red, then you'll be like guards will be all over you, and they'll like stop you any chance they get. But if you read these posters out, um, hold on, get closer. There we go. Stay back. Stop. If you if you rip these posters out, um, you uh, could actually uh, lower it down, and you'll be fine. There's a guy up there. I don't know if I'll be able to get him, but let's see. There we go. Those guys, if you see them running, they're thieves, I guess, or they steal money. I'm not really sure. But they're really a pain in the ass to catch. And I'm going to let you guys know that. If you guys are going to chase those guys, you have to be really good at chasing them. Because I try, and I'll be close to them, and you got to tackle them or do something. But 50% more for the chance, or 25 I don't know, percent something, you'll lose them. So if you guys see them right away, just try to act on it and equip your daggers or, I mean, your throwing knives. And that's an easy way for you to, guys get, to get them. If not, if you want to catch up and put to the challenge, then just do that. All right, well, let's go ahead and do this. And I guess we got to go talk to, um, what's his name? Um, uh, Leonardo da Vinci. Ezio, you are still alive. Look at this place. The past two years have been kind to you. But you are not the same at all, are you? I was hoping you might be able to help me with something. Anything for you, my friend. Ha <laughs> ha! You found another one! How exciting! Hmm. This one is tricky to break. Clever in its use of ancient languages. Maybe if I just... Oh! Oh! It seems to be a manual of sorts for different assassination techniques. May I see it? Wait, what's that? It's not so much a design this time, just a series of sketches. Hmm, what to make of all this? Ha <laughs> ha, of course. And why not? What an inspired idea. Can you make it for me while I try what's in that manual fragment? Take it. I'll have my assistant set up some dummies for you to practice with. Hey, Vincenzo! Oh, 
All right, remember this part. Um, his assistant, I guess, put some dummies, and you gotta practice some move, new moves you guys learn and stuff like that. Um, I'll just, you know, you'll see right now. I think it's funny when I first did this uh, when I was playing with my other file. The dummies to me almost looked realistic, and I was like, oh wait, they're just dummies. It's like if you notice that one's just move right now. Press to assassinate. What in the world? I guess I gotta jump on high for that one. Okay, let's kill this guy first. I gotta go up here. Right now we go back to Leonardo because he has the weapon done for us. I've done it. Come quickly. Look. Take it. Try it. Thank you, Leonardo. Non c'è di che. There's someone I need to see while I'm here. I cannot approach him publicly. Would you know a way? La Volpe. The fox. Shh. Papisco. But do you know where a fox might roam? Perhaps near the Mercato, where the thieves dwell. Sta attento, amico. Alright, so we gotta go meet the fox. <laughs> that, that, that quest at the beginning <laughs> tricked the shit out of me because I thought we were actually looking for a fox when I got there. But it's not. You're just looking for a dude named the fox. But it's 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 it was a hard quest for me at first because I didn't know exactly what the hell I was supposed to do. But once you figure it out, it's not that bad. You just gotta you know be on your feet and be able to get that guy. But I'll show you guys in a bit. Let me climb up here and get this viewpoint. meet up the fox guy but there's a car right here so let me take care of this dude so I'll be able to go and um, <clears throat> the rooftops no don't pick him up ah, shit oh well <laughs> that's like a rag doll all right let's go uh, to the market market no mercado whatever This, this quest is a bit hard, especially if you're doing it in a PC like I am, because this is for the computer, the, this Assassin's Creed. So, um, in order for you to catch this guy, you got to tackle him, and that's, uh, you got to run, which is, you press W, and uh, you hold, um, you hold, uh, what do you call it, um, you hold W, and you hold the space bar, and the left mouse, yeah, the left mouse, and then you got to press shift whenever you're going to capture this guy. A guy running down there. Hold on, I'm gonna take see if I can take care of him up here. What the hell? Is that him? Why not so? I've some other 
Tappeti! Tappeti da sogno! I think this might be him. Did he disappear? I hit that guy though. I think that guy was just a regular thief. Where is this guy at? He's around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. Fox hunt. Locate and walk through the fox. Alright, here we go. Uh, I thought I had. You're supposed to start the quest at the end of that. Alright. He's around here somewhere. Remember, I can. Here somewhere. Mi mamá se la llevó. Yo no sé, ellos salieron. Sí. Está dormido. My pouch, my money. You're making a big mistake, my friend. I apologize about that, guys. Uh, somebody was asking me a question. I know they wouldn't ask me that. So I apologize. But yeah, we're chasing this guy now. Return what you've stolen. Would if I could, but I can't. I really have no interest in hurting you. So give me back my money and we'll call it even. Not so fast. What do you want? Who are you? They call me many things. <laughs> Murderer. Tagliagole. Thief. But you may call me La Volpe. At your service, Messer Ezio. <laughs> How do you know my name? <laughs> It is my business to know everything in this city. Isn't that why you're here? Indeed. I need to find someone. To know where he'll be before even he does. Who? Francesco de Pazzi. There's word on the street of a caravan just arrived from Roma. A secret meeting at sunset tonight. You can learn something of Francesco's whereabouts there. Do you know where it is to be held? Ma certo. Let me know when you are ready. And we'll go. Ah, yes. <laughs> Here is your money. If you guys want, you could go back to that, pause it, and read. But like I said before, I want to apologize for that last vi for the last for the last thing. Uh, uh, they were asking me a question in Spanish, and I had to answer basically. So I do apologize for that. All right, so uh, I gotta meet this guy back over there, but uh, let's go do that in a bit. something I want to show you guys is actually pretty awesome uh, I don't have them I thought I did but you get smoke bombs and they'll be like right there next to the money back to the uh, middle right there I was gonna show you guys something pretty awesome but I don't have it never mind we'll skip it let's just get this started follow me but we must move fast think you can keep up that's your problem Oh, they gave him the least star. That's just great. <laughs> what are you doing? 
doing back there? I said to keep up with me. Here we are. Francesco Di Pazzi is meeting his people inside that church. How do I join them? There are catacombs that run under the city. They will lead you to a place where you can eavesdrop on the meeting. Grip that stone handle, turn it, then slide it down. Thank you for all your help, Volpe. Mm. Buona fortuna. I guess we gotta go down there. There are cars here. Great. Oh, we're gonna handle this right now, actually. Handle it Batman style. I'm Batman! I think he ran. I don't know. There's a poster around here somewhere. I think it's on the other side. These guys are so funny. I'm gonna show you a trick right now. You gotta talk to them and bribe them so that way they'll stop talking about you. But you give them a good amount, but you could take a bag watch. Bribe them, they'll talk about something else. You walk away. And then you walk to them again. Next week's public mass with the cardinal will have to be cancelled. Take your money. Pray for his recovery and the confinement of the dread death to the small... Alright, so let's go do this real quick. <clears throat> You know, doing this part right here, it reminds me of what he call it. Uh, uh, there's this catacombs in, in uh, I think it's this this part of time or something. But there's still, I think it's in uh, Spain or France. I think it's France. I don't know. I don't know if this is the same thing. But there are these catacombs that are kind of like this, and um, they have like thousands of bones in there and stuff like that. And they have discovered a few of them, but some of them haven't been discovered. And they're like, it's a pretty cool but yet creepy area. Uh, there's information on how you guys could actually look at that. It's actually pretty cool. But I don't know if, it's, if they got it from this game or, you know, because I know I know the, the catacombs from France or Paris, if I remember correct. A lot of parkour involved. 